train wreck amps what a name so i got intrigued uh, into what train wreck is um caveat i didn't know anything about train wreck before i watched a video by 5 watt world and if you are a amp nerd like me um please watch that video 5 watt world and uh, you know the the jeff mcclain basically demos the amp and I, th i think it's one of the best uh amp demo videos and amp information videos out there do check them out and everything that i know uh, or i'm talking about is from that video so uh having said that i i saw that video and what intrigued me is uh, my background is i work for a company which deals with electrical and electronic circuits and and we build stuff so um what intrigued me is uh, you know the level of detail that the amp creator uh, ken fisher went to make his amp sound the way it sounded uh, including 3d placement of you know the 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 power components and then of course the aluminum chassis so that the interference is minimal now a little bit of history about the amps but you know if you if you're not an amp nerd and you know you're not interested in the history go to the second section which deals with sound but if you're an amp nerd like me let's talk a little bit about the amps so uh, ken was one of those passionate builders and and uh, the clients include uh, the likes of nofler uh, billy gibbons eddie van halen and, and and a few more and it was one of those very very tight and small operations where only a few hundred amps were built so very very hard to get your hands on one though the legacy of ken fisher continues today they still have some of their uh, models uh, the website is trainwreck.com trainwreck express trainwreck liverpool and the rocket and all of these models are available in smaller formats so do check out the website beautiful website gives you a lot of legacy now coming to uh, the sound of the amp the only way i can describe the sound is it sounds like a marriage between a um, plexi or any of the marshall models and a vox ac30 so it retains um, and it retains the 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 growliness or a punch of a marshall but at the same time uh, it also chimes to give you an example let me just play maybe a g chord and a c chord to uh, explain what i'm trying to say <laughs> This is not the best sound example because I, I'm in my temporary uh, workstation, as you can see. You don't see my amps around. Uh, you're hearing this through uh, a Blackstar uh, IDCO 40 being used as a monitor. That is a headphone out going into a Blackstar. But the sound examples are recorded ones, so you'll hear the sound there. Uh, yeah. So coming back to the sound of the amp, it's a perfect. pairing of of a marshall and an ac30 uh, in my opinion and uh, where does it really shine through it sounds beautiful in that edge of breakup uh, kind of an area which is my personal favorite for any amp i don't like ultra clean amps and i don't like ultra high gain amps i like to take amps which are medium gain and you know put the you know amp in an area where you know you start hearing the edge of breakup and the hx storm uh, emulates that beautifully uh, if for uh, those of you out there who who are interested in the patches uh, or i'm using an impulse response i'm using a, a fender hot rod impulse response on this i'll be putting the screenshots towards the end of the video and i'll also upload the impulse response for you to download for free these are free impulse responses which are collected over a period of time so you can download that and then uh, replicate and recreate the sound all the sounds that you hear in this video are a single uh, patch where i'm not tweaking anything apart from maybe changing the guitar or you know, and you can see that which guitar i'm using and maybe pick up combination and playing with the volume knob i'm not doing anything to the patches at all 
so and that's that's how i like to i'm very old school in my approach and that's how i like to keep my uh, you know patches and 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 that's what makes me happy uh, about the hx storm that uh, unlike some of the processors i i used to hate processors before i got this uh, they kind of behave the models kind of behave like a real amp so that's that's beautiful but that's uh, individual preference coming back to uh, the simulation a lovely simulation I, i'm not too sure which model that they are emulating here but uh, again perfect for playing maybe old school blues like um if i can think about a couple of songs um i can think of maybe uh, you know older blues breakers or um you no know, any of those records clapton records um uh, rambling on or something of that sort and uh, to to demonstrate the edge of breakup sound uh, what i'm going to take is i'm going to take maybe a progression like uh, wind cries mary uh, by jimmy hendrix so as an example the reason for that is the amp really shines through when you're playing those bluesy lines where you're mixing up um you know um chords and and some lead lines or uh, um chords with voice leading kind of a situation <coughs> the amp really the the sound really shines through so let's check out that sound and uh, as usual this is you no know, thank you so much for all your support and viewership uh, it's been really helpful it's been uh, encouraging me to make newer videos um, and um, i would really love if you can hit that subscribe button and like button if you find this video useful and as usual the patches the screenshots of that will be towards the end uh, the impulse response will be available for download and i'm also putting the link to 5 watt world uh, video which discusses train wreck amps and where all my knowledge about the amp is coming from and uh, also uh, a link to uh, jeff mcelian's uh, youtube channel amazing teacher and uh, I do catch us uh, you know Brooklyn broadcast or whatever he calls them uh, whenever I can. So um having said all of that thank you so much for watching let us check out um you know a few sound samples and um, you know towards the end you can see the patches that I have used have fun do subscribe and thank you so much for your support.